marking is there, so air fluid level in the stomach. And the right side, below the rib, there you are having an air under the diaphragm. So that is the, the x-ray showing air under the diaphragm on the right side, sir. And so that white right, radio opaque is liver, that line is diaphragm, you can put, you put your pen on there, pen, ah, that part. So air under the diaphragm usually seen in duodenal perforation, hollow viscous perforation, it can be stomach, it can be small bowel, duodenum, large bowel, anything. Hollow viscous perforation, peritonitis, regarding peritonitis they may ask you, so you have to tell them. Okay, ah, next exercise. Ah, this is also an x-ray of the chest showing multiple Horseshoe. So these are secondaries in the Cannonball. chest. Cannonball. Cannonball. So the secondaries in the chest, you, when you tell, they ask you where from the primary will come. That you remember PK40, breast, kidney, prostate, head, head, bony cancers, all that causes, even lung carcinoma. Causes secondaries in the lung are any primary. All that major organs you remember and you need that. Okay? Prostatic carcinoma, carcinoma, colon, carcinoma, liver, okay, and carcinoma of the testes, carcinoma of the breast, thyroid, and lung. Okay, next exhibit. Again, here under the diaphragm only. See the right side. Right side here, diaphragm and here only the liver key, the ribs skin. Okay, ah. the repeated exhibit is better. The next thing is important. So, the better exhibit is just remember that. So usually multiple, uh, uh, this is stridulum So stridulum is the commonest cause for cannula and radio opaque densities you have to show and regarding something about IVP, intravenous, pilogram or intravenous urogram, they call nowadays the name will change. Okay, what is that used injection? Urogram. So it's a radio opaque substance. How much they use? First, you have to give uh, 0.1 ml for the sensitivity, hypersensitivity. Then, if the patient tolerates, you can give for 25 to 30 ml intravenous. Then, you have to take the X-rays. First is KUP. Before giving the radio dye, intravenous dye, you have to take uh, radio KUP X-ray because the primary X-ray must be there. After that, you remember 5, 15, 30. After five minutes, fill in nephrogram. Ureter and bladder. 5, 15, and 30. 5, 5, and 30. 5, 5, and 30. Okay? So, IVP x ray on the iPod button. Ah, then what you are holding? Left hand. 5, 5. It is the money, right hand. Ah. Are the isolation dilatation, lower part? Ah. See, the isolation. And I do x ray, sir. Hey, ultra bit, no. So then you tell that sir, stand and calculus kidney. Then they may ask you different causes, investigations, management, all that. Okay. What is that X-ray? This is an X-ray like valvulus, valvulus large bowel. A balloon shape is there. So it is valvulus X-ray, both the same. In the valvulus, okay? Sigmoid valvulus or colonic valvulus, it was just pissed on the mat. Just came with the X-ray, so it's just in the mat. Just came with the bullet, it's just in the mat. Sorry, I'm going to show you the idea. So that's how we should have not done it.
डायफ्रामेटिक एरिया एक्सरे उठाने में यूनिट लो डायफ्रामेटिक एरिया में मदद से देखिए आ नेक्स्ट इनके मन में दिस सेम एयर अंडर डायफ्राम का आगे रेंडो यानी मल्टीपल अफ्रेक्शन एक्सरे उन्हें चुड़ा दे मल्टीपल फ्लूइड लेवल्स आ दिस मिडिल वन मिडिल वन थर्ड थर्ड एक्सरे ही शोइंग मल्टीपल फ्लूइड लेवल्स दैट स्टेप लेयर पैटर्न अंडर का स्मॉल पावर आ दैट आर ऑफ so more than three fluid levels indicate obstruction small bowel obstruction okay that middle one they may ask you what is the x-ray and sir it is actually showing step ladder pattern erect abdomen actually erect abdomen ah inka this is lateral view again personal my insulate is and my doctor narrow part of the esophagus so that's it uh. next are the eye x-ray should be fine right uh. that is percutaneous trans hepatic cholangiography so that an intrahepatic duct system that middle one middle one okay so in the lot we go at view lot and this one is the side one so that is the nasogastric tube inserted into the duct system and radio that is injected and you have to take the x ray so that is showing percutaneous trans hepatic cholangiography percutaneous do it usually usually they never you are expecting obstructive jaundice so the tube we could hang out with the other side here cp is different here cp endoscopy will be there so endoscope so endoscope beyond the outer view you know, from there you will get out that but the tube whenever you are seeing the tube uh, ड्रेनेटमी You put the T tube and switch every CPD. So T tube is there. You can do this. T and this is out of the limb. T for? Okay. The better question is there. So the outside T tube. So where you put T tube? What are the indications for T tube? So they will ask you. So colloidal cotomy, colloidal cotomy, opening of the common bile duct for stone disease. मेमोग्राफी का प्रॉब्लम इंक्लूडिंग चेस्ट डिजिटल डिजिटल एक्सरे यू जस्ट लिप इट लाइक दैट स्पेसिफिक फीमेल एक्सरे जस्ट इंक्लूडिंग अंड इट इज लुकिंग लाइक ग्रउंड ग्लास अपियर यूज यू सी इन प्रेग्नेट इन प्रेग्नेट बस कर दे रहा हूँ दिस एक्सरे शोस देर इज ए मीडिया स्टैंडर्ड शिफ्ट टू दि राइट सैड सी दिस राइट मार्क कदा The cardiac shadow is pushed to the right side, so probably this may be a case of a diaphragmatic hernia. So the left side diaphragm is pushed up. See, it is affecting the cardiac shadow side. So probably it may be a diaphragmatic hernia. Excellent. Hello. Hiatus hernia, ni ko, adi barium, barium logo ni hiatus. Near the hiatus, is a major hiatus hernia. That side of the X-ray. Yes, sir. In case of lymph nodes. See, you remember standard calculus, multiple fluid levels, air under the diaphragm. Then this uh, 
డైఫ్రమాటిక్ హెర్నియా వాల్యులెస్ ఓకే <laughs>